Hey brats, welcome back. We are going to play another chapter of Stifled. I want to say a quick thank you to Taka, who suggested that we do a heart rate monitor. So I'm trying that out. You see that up there on the screen this time. We're going to see see how worked up and freaked out we get. So uh, even already, usually my resting heart rate is between like 60 to 70 beats per minute. So in sitting here recording, I realized that I don't know if I'm hyped to play something or if I'm thinking about the scariest game is already I'm sitting kind of high. So it'll be interesting to see when I look back at the footage because I'm not going to be able to see this. Uh, if my heart rate was down, if I was actually relaxed all during the game, or if the whole time I'm just going to be in this tense state where my heart rate's climbing and then freaking out. So let's get into the game and play some more Stifled. All right, continue. Last thing I remember, we were out in front of the house and the car was sitting there. So this should take us right back where we were. <laughs> Already I feel the anxiety coming back from last time. Oh, okay. Did I have a purse? Or do I try and call it a satchel and pretend it's not a purse? Let's just go in the house. Your kids have a lot of pairs of shoes that look the same. Okay. Are you an autonomous? That's just a creepy painting to have in your house. I guess it's from the orphanage admission. Victim of brutal murder case found next to dead parents staring blankly and non-responsive to first responders. Not responsive to any external stimulus when first admitted. Multiple child psychi psychiatrists declined uh, treating him after a few sessions. Started talking again last month. Has totally no memories of the murder. Has totally no memories. Some professional wrote this. I don't like that. Where's the light switch? Ah. Uh, oh, that's better. Oh, God. Why? Why? No. Means no. Bryce. Just... No. End of discussion. Ah. That's a creepy thing to say. All of that. Dear Mommy and Daddy. Scary looking child. Someone's driving away from the house. Scary looking child again. Ah. That's creepy, but kids drawing stuff generally tend to just be kind of creepy, I feel like. There's an awful lot of beds here. And toothbrushes. Yeah, this must be at the orphanage. That's why there's so many weird kids' shoes. Oh, gosh, no. No, 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 no. Creepy. Why is that such a creepy thing? And why are the lights flickering out? Oh, great. I'm locked in here. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna hide under the bed. Uh, oh, God, no. Ah! Uh, uh, I took like a whole week before I played this game again, and I still am not sure that was enough time for me to feel ready. Oh, gosh. And there's nothing to pick up and throw out there so I can see. Oh, God. Okay, okay. Just go. Okay. Get to the candle. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, can I pick up the candle so I can see? Nope. Oh, God, did you see that? There's a shadow of two, like, beings when the light flickered out. Oh. Oh, not the basement. God. I don't want it. I don't want it. Oh, God. Why? Why do houses even have to have basements? My grandma's house has the creepiest basement. For those of you that don't know about me, I grew up. Uh, a lot of some of my late teen years, I lived with my grandma, and she had the creepiest basement. I don't know what that. Oh, geez, was that there before? Oh, I don't want to. What is this? A creepy hole that I have to go in. Apparently, probably where bad things happen in the orphanage. Oh God. Oh. Oh God. Uh. Uh. Okay, okay, you're okay. Oh, God. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Just go, just go. Just go. 
Oh, God. So apparently my heart rate monitor stopped working, so I don't know how long that was down. Uh, oh, God. The sound of my footsteps, I hate this. But I think I got it back up and running, so hopefully it stays up for the rest of the video. Why can't there be any rocks or anything to pick up? If giving you rocks to throw in the beginning was just like a, a beginner thing in the first level, I'm, I'm gonna be really sad. I don't want you. I want you to leave me alone. God. What is this place? Just get through it. Just get through it. Oh god, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I don't like it. My cat just rubbed up against my leg. That's not okay. Oh, I don't want to go back this way. I don't remember all these rocks here. So I feel like this has changed. Rocks will make me feel safer. Oh. Lots of rocks makes me feel safer. rocks. I find rocks comforting. That's not comforting. Moose! Just hang in there!
Are you kidding me? That's gonna be so loud. Where are we going now? Oh god. Let's just throw that. Oh my god. Why did I throw that? This is not okay. This is not okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Just keep it. Just keep it. No matter how slow you move, it makes tons of noise. Oh my goodness. You just stay up there. I'm okay with, with no one coming down here. in the frame. Just know eventually in these scenes there's gonna be like water that makes this kind of noise and those enemies and I'm gonna have to like distract them while I'm trudging through the water. Not that screaming again. <sighs> I was just about to say all this flowing water is nice and then I saw an enemy. Developers did a great job making this atmosphere super creepy. The dolls, the children, the cages, like these are all things that I would imagine are triggers for a lot of people. And so it's a good way to really make the game seem scary to a wide audience. Can't I find another rock? I knew I should have brought one with me. I just didn't want to go back for it. Hello? Hello? Looks like Rose is gone. But her crying isn't. Uh, Let's get you out of there. Oh god. Oh, creepy, 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 creepy. Creepy. Oh. oh. I told you Rose was bad. Oh. 
unsettling. Okay. Okay. Creepy sleeping bag? Ah! More of these creepy home movies? Can I put them in? No. I would like to know more about my family. Ah. Oh my goodness, we're back in a house. That was slightly unsettling. Ew. It's, what is on the... I'm sure that's... Is that supposed to be the crust? Because that looks like maggots, and that is freaking me out. Okay. Oh my goodness. Creepy. Whew. Oh, I feel like I should probably stop here and leave this for another episode. People said this is only about three or four hours long, and I think we've done two hours, so I'm guessing there's only one more hour. Uh, so yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and stop this episode now. Whew, that wasn't so bad. I feel like the first, first chapter was definitely kind of scary as you're learning the mechanic. Once you get the mechanic down, at least so far, it's not as challenging trying to keep the enemies at bay. Uh, we'll see. So, uh, thank you. <laughs> Thanks for coming and hanging out with me today. And, uh, oh, my heart feels pretty good. I don't think it got too crazy there. So, sorry the monitor went out there for a minute, but uh, hopefully we'll work out the kinks.